Hey friends, Joe the Farmer here, and today is one of those days I'm really excited about. Uh, in this video, we're actually gonna be doing some wildlife management. We're gonna feed some deer. I'm gonna show you what kind of deer feed that we use, and uh, I'm gonna pull out the 800 pound Texas Hunter Extreme Feeder. This is a rotomolded feeder on a steel frame. It is a beast, and I cannot wait to get that thing out there. I'm gonna have to use the tractor to move it because it's really heavy. Um, but yeah, today's just one of those days where we have fun. We enjoy this weather, this beautiful day. We decompress a little bit from the work week and uh, take care of our wildlife, so. Love those VP racing cans, man. Make life so much easier. So much easier. Okay. Let's go get the feeder. All right, so I'm trying to figure out a way I could rig this on here without having to put the bucket on, because I can just throw a tons of sacks of feed on here. But uh, here it is. It's about a year and a half old and still looks brand new. I mean, this thing is solid. All right, let me see if I can figure something out here. This right here is probably a little bit suspect, but for these purposes, I think we'll be okay. All right, let's go set this thing down and uh, go to step two, filling it. Okay, we got it up here. Clearly this is overkill. You don't need a tractor to move a Texas Hunter feeder. I'm gonna unload it. I'm gonna set it right here because I actually have a Tacticam reveal right under you. As far as a trail camera goes, it's a cellular camera. We use, uh, did a review on it and we use these. Uh, I have a, three of them here on the farm. We have a lot of cell cameras here on the farm, but that's one of the ones we've really enjoyed using. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing unloaded and then we'll go get some protein and we'll put it in there and then we'll just wait for pictures. I need to put some batteries in this camera though. But anyway, let's do it. Okay, so that is 800 pounds, where are we at? Ah, there we are. 800 pounds of uh, Buck Bourbon's new protein feed. So let's hop up here and take a look at what it looks like. This is kind of dodgy. Okay, so when they say it'll hold 800 pounds, I think it'll hold 800 pounds and that's about it. But you can see we're topped off here and yeah, you know, we have some protein in there. We have some corn. And this is the apple, like an apple caramel uh, flavor. And I mean, as I smell it, it smells exactly like apple and caramel. There's a little bit of mineral in there you can smell, but uh, should be great stuff. Now we have to keep the raccoons out of it and make sure that just the deer eat it. So we'll find out. Ooh, okay. So we've got the Buck Bourbon um, Barrel Proof is what it's called. It's called Buck Bourbon Barrel Proof. And again, this is a protein feed. It comes through a gravity feeder. Great stuff. So we're going to move on. I'm going to change the batteries in the Tacticam reveal. And then I need to hop out there and put the Boss Buck 
200 pound feeder up and we'll just fill up with 200 pounds of feed and you know make it real simple so so apparently the batteries are not dead I clicked it to set up and never clicked it to on so yeah go me so this tactic camera reveal camera has been fantastic again we're running I think three of them three or four of them but if you look here this gives you a little bit of a screen and right there is where you go to set up and I probably waited for it to set up make sure I had 4g coverage full battery and just never clicked it on never clicked it on oh well but that should give us a pretty good look at that feeder feeder straight ahead perfect love it all right onward and upward Okay, so I'm gonna try this boss buck feeder right here in front of this hay barn. Uh, Betsy and I actually hunted out of this area uh, last season and we had a great hunt. Every time I've sat out here, I'll just put a pop-up blind here in the barn. Every time we've sat here, we've seen deer, which is just amazing. You don't usually, that never happens, right? Um, but anyway, I'm gonna put this boss buck here and then back here, let me show you real quick. So I have two cameras here. I have a Browning Strike Force Apex, which is a great camera. Fantastic static camera. Uh, takes really, really, really great pictures. Uh, the one under it is one that someone sent me. I, I was testing, and don't buy it. If you see that, don't buy it. Um, but Strike Force is good. However, I'm going to put my Covert uh, Black Hawk LTE camera here, and this way I have cell pictures. And uh, the Covert is, you know, the Covert and the Tacticam, and even the Browning Defender Scout Pro. Those are really my favorite cameras. Again, if you're new to the channel, we've done some uh, trail camera reviews. If you'd like to see us do that and just kind of bring them all together and say what we like about or dislike about them, you know, leave it down in the comments. Maybe we'll do that. So I need to go ahead and put that uh, covert camera here and get to work because I'm short on time. So you may ask what I like about this camera so much. Very consistent, uh, excellent picture quality and the app is great because you can take a real-time photo so what's handy is that if i'm wondering what the weather is here or if i'm wondering if the camera's working at all i can click take a real-time photo and within seconds it will send me a photo of what's happening at that very specific second so if you have a property that you're uh, hunting in that you know is not in your backyard then you can use something like this and you don't always know exactly exactly what the weather is so if you're getting rain on your food plot you just planted there's an opportunity so anyway i'm gonna fill up this boss buck feeder and then we're good to go. So, again, giving you an idea of what's in here. Corn, protein, mineral, Good stuff. Okay, so I could always read off the label of what's in this Buck Bourbon barrel proof, but what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take a picture of it and put it in here. You can read all the ingredients, you can pause it here if you want to, and then uh, just get a kind of a good idea of what's in the mix. Smells great, hopefully we'll have good success, and if I have a lot of deer pictures by the time I post this video, I'll put the pictures in. All right, y'all, so that is our day of putting out deer feed. Uh, I do appreciate y'all coming along with me. It's funny, I was thinking earlier, I was like, you know, I just really need a day to get out there and do some land management, deer management stuff, just to relax and decompress, because this is truly what I enjoy doing. It's what I'm passionate about doing. And, um, you know, I was like, maybe I'll just go out there without the cameras. And I thought to myself, it's so much fun having the cameras with me. It just, it seems like I have company. It seems like I get to share this with all of you. And hopefully that if you're into this kind of thing too and you enjoy doing it, that you leave a comment and kind of let me know where you are, where you hunt. And if you, even if you don't hunt, if you just like to feed wild animals or, you know, wildlife, that's that's cool too. Because this is all part of just land management and giving back to, uh, to the earth what we've taken. You know, we took three deer off this property last year uh, between Nick, JB, and I. And, you know, we really need to make sure that we're giving back and putting back and uh, making sure the fawns have an excellent chance to survive and that we have sustainability moving forward. 
I've said this in other videos, it's kind of like planting an apple tree. You want to fertilize the tree, prune the tree, make sure it's healthy. And when you take the apples from the tree, you want to make sure you're continuing to, uh, you know, make that tree healthy and survive so that in the future you can pick apples as well. So, and I love watching just what kind of wildlife will show up on that camera. It's just, to me, that's, that's what this is all about. And it, you know, it's just an amazing um, opportunity to have this land and just, you know, have all of you kind of check in and watch with us. So I do appreciate you watching this video. If you do enjoy this kind of thing, hit the like button. It does help us here on the farm. We'd appreciate if you did that because, you know, the likes, really help other people see these videos and you know we want to share them with as many folks would like to see them and um, the product is buck bourbon that we've used today barrel proof we've had fantastic success with buck bourbons 110 proof which is their uh, mineral kind of attractant they have a mineral pure mineral that's for building mineral sites which i'm going to share with you in another video but um, this is their barrel proof protein feed and i can't imagine it's anything but great you know george is a fantastic wildlife manager and um, if he says to do it, then I trust him. So anyway, I appreciate you watching this video. I'll see you on the next one. I'm Joe the Farmer. We out.